the well is dry, we have to go outside the well for resources to inspire us. That's why artists balance their time sitting in the studio depressed because of the solitude. And so when we finish the piece, we want to get away from it, drink in some sensory input from the outdoors so that we can come back and we're filled up again and something might flow out of us. Now let me paint this lens out. Welcome to our studio. This is Mr. Atomic, also known as Mark Hersey, and my twin brother Michael. Billy Gibbons wants you to uh, uh, get back in touch with him. He wants to know if your portrait is done yet. Yeah, tell him after we get back from Sausalito, we're going on a hunting trip there for electric guitars. We have not followed uh, the normal vein of artists that simply are told, paint something that's out there, arrange a still life. We uh, grew up really enjoying exploring as children and seeing new things and using our imaginations, probably because we didn't have a lot. And so we were forced to use our imagination. If we feel like doing something surrealistic, I'm certainly for it. If we want to do something um, real, that's a little more uh, conservative, as long as there's a unique angle to it. But that's our calling, is to, to do something uh, original. Originality is more important to me than trying to create something lifelike, because uh, a camera can do that much better than people. The ideas come so quickly, it's kind of humorous, because a painting of ours may take three weeks. And if I could only transfer my ideas immediately onto canvases and be done with it and, you, and the process is not that quick. Uh, I could have hundreds of thousands of paintings. You are a very bad man, Daddy. <laughs> not a bad man. Why do you smell like tapioca if you're a wooden marionette? Because they were serving that at Mickey D's this morning. Oh. Tapioca sandwiches. <laughs> if we can think of it, we can do it. So, oh, that's classic. That's classic. And you heard it here first. It wasn't Picasso who said that first, it was me. What did I say anyhow? I forgot. When I finish your pieces, they turn into a major masterpiece. When, when you finish mine, they turn into a minor masterpiece. But at any rate, I keep him around because he's a real good brush cleaner. Right. And for anybody out there that might need their brushes cleaned, my brother's the one to see. Oh, I'll hook you up with He's him. always good for a laugh or two. 